Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my YouTube channel IGOM. So in this tutorial video, I will explain you about the leader. What are the what is actually leader and what are its types and how to apply a leader in the drawings, AutoCAD drawings. So let's move on to some brief description about this. So when you talk about the leader basically leader is a line or sp line with an arrowhead at one end and multi-line text object or block at other end okay so it's all about the leader next when we talk about the types there are basically two types of the leader one is the leader with text content and second one is the leader with block content so leader leader basically is consisting of arrowhead leader line landing line and multi text content or else block content so the basic difference is in the leader with text content having multi text and in the leader with block content having the block in the form of block so let's move on to the one example what is actually and what it shows so i will show you one drawings so here is one drawing you can see how we actually work so this is multi line text leader with multi line text like it's showing the object what is this object and what is this object so in order to show any notation of or show the any naming of the any object is in the form of arrowhead and leader line and landing line with the multi text or block content so we will uh, we'll go with the leader so two types of leader means here you can see this is one of the types that is multi multi text leader and second one here you can see this is block content block content means in the form of a b c d or one two three if you want to show uh, with circle or uh, anything so we'll go with the, that is a block content leader so how we can apply in the AutoCAD so we'll see one by one so let's move on to the AutoCAD drawing same things I will uh, draw uh, same object I will give this same naming in the drawings so let's move on to the AutoCAD so here you can see this is the same drawings is there so I will I will give the first is a multi text leader okay so shortcut for a leader is mld okay or else you you can find here also this is all about leader if you drop down you will find uh, many options that is leader add leader remove leader align collect okay this uh, all i will show you later first will uh, go with the multi leader so for shortcut is multi line uh, leader text m l d hit enter so now it's asking they specify the leader arrowhead so i want to name it, name this object so this is actually column so i will give uh, first we'll see what is this uh, naming this is ISHB 250 at 51 kg per meter so ISHB five hundred at fifty five kg per meter okay sorry kg per meter so click outside so if you look it's very small we can't uh, find the proper visualization so what is there actually it's if you zoom out you you come to know it's uh, what is it's written but uh, in order to uh, get a clear visualization so you have to modify so i will show you how to modify this one so here you can see annotation drop down if you go with the third option that is standard if you drop down here 
and you will find the manage there are two types actually one is the annotative second is the standard so i will talk about the standard so below you can see the manage multi leader style if you click here the one dialog box will open here you can modify so you can go this way also or else you can go with the shortcut so for the shortcut is mls if you press mls and hit enter same thing will open so you go to the modify in the content you have to keep as a m text only because in the form of text we are writing this way if you if you go with the block so it will be in the form of block so now we are uh, writing in the form of multi line text so we'll keep as it is m text next here you can see the object uh, text height so you have to increase this one now it is uh, default is 0.18 so i will make it as a 50 example we'll see if it is uh, uh, very big we will reduce again and here you can change the color also so suppose if i make as a green okay and same thing is here if you go with the leader structure uh, here you can uh, change the this uh, landing landing length you can uh, adjust so i will keep as it is 100 only next uh, remaining things here leader format here also you can make uh, changes so i will make this color is uh, okay this this color i will make and uh, here you can see the different types of arrowhead is present so which one you want so close field architectural oblique close field uh, close blank etc so i will keep as the close field only so here you will see the sizes of the arrow so you have to increase so let's say 25 we'll see if it is clear then okay otherwise again i have to change so now these are the things you can make adjustment then click on ok and click on set current then close now you can see it's a clear proper visual you can properly you can see okay so next time we need not to modify again and again it's already uh, apply for all the so you have to text M mls sorry mld shortcut hit enter and if you want to give this one naming so what is this also the object this is cleat angle 90 by 90 by 81 so this is cleat angle Ninety by ninety by eight mm. Okay. Next, uh, this is pedestal fifteen hundred thousand nine hundred. Okay. Pedestal fifteen thousand. 1500 900 100, 000, 100, 000. okay so you can write uh, whatever the object is uh, there you have to write uh, uh, correctly okay so this is all about the multi text this one first types that is a uh, leader content with uh, multi text okay next is uh, second one is a uh, leader that is leader with uh, block content how to create this block so we'll see that one also so before going to give the block you have to change in the settings uh, like uh, here it is in the form of m text so you have to change in the block form same thing you have to go to the setting that is mls multi leader style manager go to modify here you contain you can see it is a m text you have to change into a block if you change you can see in the preview you can see so in the source block you can uh, make as a detail call out or a slot anything in the form of here you can see different shapes are present triangle hexagon box circle so i will go with circle okay then here is uh, 
masking the color of the circle you can make or else leaves so i will give it a yellow okay next uh, is the scale scale means it's very small in the preview you can see it's very small so you have to increase so i will keep uh, example 5 then uh, anything so you can make a change here also you can make changes but it's already in uh, multi text i have changed so no need to change so only these things you can make the changes then click on ok set current close so go to again m or else shortcut you type the mld enter so which one you want to give the naming this one so this dialog box will be uh, will open so you have to give the naming image with it inside the circle what you want to show so if you want to show one two three you have to write one two three or else a b c d i i want to show a b c d like so i will write, type a press enter or else okay so you can see how it changes and second thing uh, if you same things if you want to again it uh, enter or else then here you can write that uh, in this i will give the one now you can see same things you can write uh, you can create okay maybe okay so this is all about leader contain with that is a uh, block okay and this is all about leader contain with multi text okay next uh, we'll talk about this two command there is one uh, this four command that is add remove these are the four commands you there so we'll see one by one add add leader means we are adding uh, extra leader in that for example i will show you so this is uh, one angle is there same naming i want to show this one more arrowhead here so what i will do i will click this add one add leader click on this so which one you want this one so select this one and you drag and wherever you want to show you can show okay anything is there you can show your numbers of you can add if you don't you hit escape so no. same uh, same things if you want to uh, remove so second is remove leader so click on that remove and which one you want to remove you select this one for example i want to remove this one then press enter so it will automatically it will remove this one okay Mm. okay this one uh, remove and add i think it's uh, uh, completed now next we will uh, go with align and collect so align basically uh, what it do means uh, it makes this uh, text in, uh, in align means it makes in the in single line like i will show you the example this is the align i will select on the line and uh, click on any one example this one i will first click in this one second this one third this one and then press i will enter now it's uh, asking to click anywhere so example i will click one two three which one a i want to like in the a is there no i want in this form so i will click this one now you can see uh, if you press the ortho on f8 you can see all are in one line only okay so this is all about uh align means we are making in the all text in a single line same things if you notice this uh, collect command means all this a1 b this will collect with a single arrow so i will show you click on the collect click uh, one two three and then press enter and you can see all the three lines make into one single lines with the means all the text they uh, that what is called all the uh, blocks they collected at a single place okay so this is all about the leader i hope you're getting my all these points so if you have any doubt other than this you can uh, write on the comment box i will definitely i will give the reply so 
that's it only today's today class so next class we will move with layers okay thank you so much and if you find this is a useful video please like our video and subscribe to our youtube channel thank you so much